Yo, I'm Camilla Blay. I'm an award-winning primatologist and conservationist, and I work in wildlife rescue projects around the world. In 2020, I had the chance to go to the Peruvian rainforest to work with baby woolly monkeys at Ikama, Peru, a primate rehabilitation center. You're watching Jungle Vlogs. Générique. Quick reminder, this is the camp. It's called La Media Luna. It's where we lived. Just next to it is the Sharingal. It's a parcel of tropical rainforest where the monkeys are being rehabilitated. One day I was in the Sharingal and I was observing the forest when I noticed that the leaves were moving and I noticed a sound like animal vocalization. It was wild tamarinds. It was such a precious and incredible moment. Uh, you know, it's not the same to rehabilitate animals and to see wild animals in their natural habitat. Both are truly magical experiences, but with the baby woolly monkeys I was working with and I was seeing every day, well, they were there every day. You know, during the night they're in their enclosure and then during the day they are with us in the forest for rehabilitation. I know I'm gonna see them tomorrow, you know, but uh, with wild animals, in their natural habitat, you never know. Like even if you're on a jungle trip with a guide, you are never sure. That's what makes those moments so precious. Have you ever lived this kind of experience, like a magical encounter with wildlife? Tell me in the comments, I wanna know. Hey, you hear this? This is Tamarin's vocalization. A few days later, I went to get my sleeping bag that was drying and to get it, I had to walk through this small patch of forest that I told you about uh, in the second episode. And while I was walking this small patch of forest, I saw wild tamarinds again. Du coup, je les ai filmés un peu. Ils étaient trop mignons. Je les appelais un peu et ils venaient autour dans les arbres et ils faisaient des vocalisations, c'était trop cool. Oui. The tamarins I saw both times were probably um, saddleback tamarins, Leontocebus, as they had a brown-orange patch of fur on their lower back and white patterns on their cutie face. But I don't know which species exactly. Tamarins are small, diurnal and arboreal New World monkeys. Uh, New World monkeys live in Central and South America and Old World monkeys occur in Asia and Africa. Saddleback tamarins live in family groups of around 3 to 9 individuals and they can be found uh, quite low in the canopy, around 10 meters high. These tamarins, although not considered as a threatened species yet, are often hunted for their meat or cooked to be kept as pets. But primates are not pets. And to understand why, you can check the TikTok I made about why primates are not pets, and it's also available on my Instagram. Follow me. So the fact that these tamarins are often hunted or captured makes this encounter even more incredible because it was dangerous for them to let me see them. Like they could have fled right away, but instead they stayed and they observed me as much as I observed them. It's a little gift from nature, you know? That's one of the reasons why I love living and working in the field, because you just go out to chill or to get your dry stuff and you see so much wildlife. Là, il y a beaucoup de soleil, il fait super chaud. Et en allant chercher mon sac de couchage, du coup, J'ai vu tellement de d'insectes, genre c'était trop bien. Look everywhere a 
around you. You never know, parrots might be flying above your head. A spider might be camouflaged and hiding in tree bark. And sometimes, my lap is right on the washing line. J'allais juste récupérer mon sac de couchage pour étendre pour l'étendre au soleil et je devais le mettre sur des cordes sauf qu'en fait il y a carrément une fourmilière qui passe dessus quoi donc ça va être compliqué. When I'm in the field, I feel so connected with nature. Uh, I feel useful because I'm helping save wild animals and I feel such in harmony with nature. I feel like we're all part of nature and I feel it so strongly when I'm in the field surrounded by so much wildlife. Wildlife in the sense of flora and fauna. Wildlife is your neighbor. How crazy is that? I feel in harmony with nature but not with mosquitoes. I hate them. I hate you mosquitoes. I hate you. just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine but you just can't get into it because they would never... What about you guys? Where do you feel the most connected or in harmony with nature? I want to know. Tell me in the comments. Embark on my adventures with me guys! You can subscribe to my YouTube channel, you can follow me on Instagram, Facebook, TikTok. I have TikTok now, I'm spending way too much time on it. But most importantly, don't forget to connect with nature. Bisous!